recently, my next door neighbor had a couple dead trees that he had to have removed. He felt really unsafe that um, they were getting to where they looked like they were going to fall over. So we contracted a tree trimming place to remove them. And I went over to the tree trimming place before they had started and I asked them what they were going to do with all the extra wood. And he told me they basically cut it as small as they can and put it in a chipper and just basically discard all of it. I asked him if I could have some of it or any big pieces he might have left. He said he could pick through anything I wanted. They'd even cut it to size for me once it was on the ground. So I decided to go ahead and videotape them removing the last tree. I thought it was really, really kind of unique and I'm scared of height so I find this extremely, I find this extremely interesting. Now I didn't get to the top about 15 feet of the tree, but this tree was probably I'd say between 60 and 80 feet high. and. The picture you're seeing right now is completely above the house. And if you notice how he's moving around freely and how, I mean, I would just be scared as could be. But I love the way they cut it down, they throw the pieces down. They have about four men on the ground that are kind of making sure no one comes around, everything's safe down there. They tie off portions of the tree so if the tree ever tilts one way or the other, they can. The two men on the ground can kind of pull it or direct it a certain way. If you look towards the bottom, you can see ropes dangling, and sometimes they'll go tight. That's the two men on the ground pulling it. The other one's keeping everything clear and stuff like that. But it's really neat to watch this guy go to work and just trim this tree. You see how he just threw a big piece down? I find that. I just find it massively scary, too. I mean, I can never, ever. But it was really nice. Um, I'm not able to show you the trunk that he cuts down because that's behind the tree and behind the fence. But I'm showing you all the other top. Watch how gracefully he moves up and down and just <laughs> like there's no, nothing to be scared of. I just couldn't understand that for the life of me. And that was a really large piece. That was about three feet tall. And it's hard to tell from where he's at how big everything is. Now this is the base that's left right above the uh, house. And the house, you know, a roof on the house is about 14 to 15 feet high. So this man's a, just a six foot guy and you're looking, there's another 12, 15 feet on top of the house. Of course he just cut some now. But I just thought you might want to—I might want to share it with you to show you how neat it was, how quick they cut it down. Uh, this is sped up a little bit, but the whole thing probably took less than 30 minutes. Uh, very unique. Thanks for watching. My name's Ronnie Sutton. You've been watching. It's a wood thing.